if one real root of quadratic equation yt1 x square plus kx plus 256 equals to 0 is cube of other root then value of k is okay what you are saying that one root of this equation is cube of the other root so that means let one root given what is given the quadratic e equation yt1 x square plus k x plus 256 equals to 0 let if we consider one root as alpha okay if we consider one root as alpha then what he is saying is another root is cube of the other so then what is the another root another root is alpha cube okay if one root is alpha then another root is cube of the other then alpha and alpha cube are the roots of given quadratic equation so now we can write as sum of the roots alpha plus alpha cube sum of the roots equals to minus x coefficient by x square coefficient minus x coefficient by x square coefficient and product of the roots alpha into alpha cube equals to constant term by constant term by x square coefficient 256 by 81 and we can write this is as alpha power 4 equals to we can write this as 4 by 3 whole power 4 okay 4 by 3 whole power 4 that implies we can write alpha equals to 4 by 3 and then clearly we can write this as alpha equals to plus or minus 4 by 3 so that means once we can consider if it is plus 4 by 3 or minus 4 by 3 minus 4 by 3 power 4 again 256 by 81 or plus 4 by 3 power 4 also 256 by 81 then we can write alpha equals to plus or minus 4 by 3 now if alpha equals to plus 4 by 3 if alpha equals to plus 4 by 3 now consider this condition what it is what he is asking us to find the value of k only the relation we have the value to find the value of k is the sum of the roots now use the condition of sum of the roots what we are having over here alpha plus alpha cube equals to minus k by it one and we can write this is as alpha equals to 4 by 3 plus 4 by 3 whole cube okay 4 by 3 plus 4 by 3 whole cube which is equals to minus k by it one okay minus k by it one and if we simplify over here what we can get it as 4 by 3 plus 4 cube means 64 by 3 cube means 27 okay which is equals to minus k by it one and in the lhs if we take lcm what it is 27 three nines and nine four the 36 plus 27 one and we can write as 64 equals to minus k by it one where 27 can be cancelled out in three times okay it one and if we write this as 100 equals to minus k by 3 from this one we can write k equals to minus 300 okay k equals to minus 300 if k is equals to 4 by 3 we are obtaining it is as k is equals to minus 300 and if k is equals to minus 4 by 3 okay sorry if alpha equals to minus 4 by 3 what is the value of k and we can write as minus 4 by 3 and minus we obtain this as 64 by 27 which is equals to minus k by 81 and we can write this as minus 100 by 27 equals to minus k by 81 minus and minus will cancel out 27 threes that implies over here we obtain k is equals to plus 300 okay if alpha equals to plus 4 by 3 okay alpha equals to plus 4 by 3 we are obtaining it is as 
minus 300 and if alpha equals to minus 4 by 3 we are obtaining this as 300 and in the options what is the options given option a is minus 81 100 minus 300 144 so then what is our appropriate answer the k is equals to minus 300 then option c is the correct one okay i think you understand how to solve these type of problems thank you